All right, students, time to talk about a very special event that's going to be coming up. Falcon Day? <gasps> the Crystal Ball? Midterms! Oh, oh, come on. You all know those events happen later in the year for us. Did you not consult your handbook? We had to read that? Come on, you all paid to be here. Act like it. Now, let's begin. Our first midterm is going to go over the following. Since this is a class that focuses around writing, I'm thinking about having you guys keep a journal and the likes. It'll help me to understand your syntax and how you... Uh, it wouldn't be so bad if we were allowed to have coffee. What did you say? I said I... Ugh, forget it. I'm too tired to backtrack now. Can you seriously believe this guy bans coffee in his class? Like, what are we? In high school? Ugh, Dara, you're too loud. No, I'm not. See? No one else is complaining. No one else is sitting right next to you. I'm just saying that a ban on coffee in a college class should be illegal. We're adults! Are we, Tara? Yeah! Does an adult stay in the room all night watching Netflix? Of course! I mean, think about it! Adults, which we are, are very much strategic about their time. For example, I am going to try to avoid making too many friends this first year, if I can, so I can focus on my studies, and then senior year I'll slack off and be a happy camper. At least, that's what I'm thinking. I mean, I am also trying to look for love and stuff, too. Huh? F? You noticed it, too, huh? What do you mean? I've noticed I've been looking over here since class started. Do you think it's about the rumors going around? <laughs> it's possible. I'm hoping for the best, though, that it's not. Uh, have you heard anything new? Tara? I mean, I heard a few more rumors about you. Like? I don't think now's the time to talk about this, Ath. Maybe we should just pay attention to the lesson. Tara? <sighs> There's a rumor going around that you had four boyfriends during high school. What? Uh, was it true? I'm just asking! I didn't have any boyfriends, Tara. I kinda find that very hard to believe. You went to the same high school as me. Yeah, but I didn't know you before then. And when I did know you, it was over the guy I liked who was interested in you. We've only known each other end of high school senior year up until now. Plus, there were rumors about this kind of stuff in high school. Ugh, that's because a lot of guys were interested in me. <laughs> lucky? No, not lucky. It caused more problems than I wanted, and I wasn't even interested. I mean, I was interested in a few, but again, more trouble than it was even worth. What about Aaron? That guy I saw you with in the room. <sighs> Tara, I don't need this right now. Just... And that's all you need to know for the midterms. I'll see you all next class. Hope you all took notes. Did you take notes? No. Did you? We're screwed. screwed. Sorry about, you know, before. I guess I just had a few bitter feelings left in me over everything. It's fine, Tara. Thank you for apologizing. I just wish this wasn't happening. Av, forget about them. Huh? If you have something to say, say it to my face. Oh, my. Heard you got around. Got around where? Oh, she's playing stupid. Guys must love that. Got around as in seeing multiple guys at once. So you heard about this or you know it for a fact? Heard it. Oh, <laughs> so it must be true, right? If everyone's talking about it, yeah. Do you know how stupid that is? 
to believe a rumor over having actual proof. Well, words can be true. Words can also be harmful. Because they're true? No, because they can be spiteful and damaging. You don't even know me, yet you feel you have the right to talk about me? Because you have nothing better to talk about in your sad little lives? Oh, is someone getting mad? Just stop harassing me. If you want to do something productive, then mind your own business. Oh, she's getting mad. Screw off! Wow, I didn't think you could be so brutal. Huh? Oh, Afmau. I just wish these kinds of things didn't happen. Why me? Af, it isn't your fault. People just... I don't know. They want to talk and they don't want to talk about their own faults. So they talk about others to validate themselves. But why are they talking about me? None of anything is true. The only guys I hang out with are Aaron and sometimes Garth. People assume things? I, I don't know. All I know is that I'm proud of you for standing up for yourself. But what is that going to accomplish? They'll just talk about me more. <laughs> Elf. If you're going to continue to go out and about, we're going to need to set some rules. First rule is don't do anything stupid. I don't want to hear that you got into trouble that involves any kind of authority. They will call your parents and that will be the end of you ever going out again. Two, you need to be back in your room before 10 p.m. If you're planning on staying out later, you need to let me know somehow. Let's see. Here, leave this bat sticker on your mirror if you're going to stay out longer than that. Why this? Bat signal. What? Old man joke. I don't get it. Never mind. Now listen, it's very incognito. Just keep it in sight. These rules are subject to change at any time, and if you get caught, I'm going to act like I don't even know you. Got it? Understood. Why did you let me go? <clears throat> to the movies. All of my dad's goons, I mean agents, would have never ever allowed that to happen. You've even allowed me to stay out later after a few classes. Why? Most of us have hearts. It's just not in our job to show them. Then why did you? I don't like seeing a young man cooped up during what could be the best years of his life. Truth be told, I have zero idea of why you need to be protected in the first place, or why the hell you need that cloth on your face. Ugh. Uh, I don't care to know. At the end of the day, it sucks to watch a young man basically be a prisoner. College was a wonderful time for me. Oh man, the ladies I managed to swoon. You wouldn't believe how good I was at- I don't want to know! What? You don't think I know? I found those pictures of that one gal under your bed. Afmo, was it? No, I have no idea who that girl is. It sounds like someone I've never seen before in my life. Word of advice, hide sentimental pictures of your crush somewhere other than under the bed. It's cliche. No one ever goes in my room! Regardless, it's evident that you went out with her to the movies that night. I tailed you for a bit to make sure you weren't up to no good. You were there the whole time? No, no. I left once I realized it was a group outing. I'm glad to see you socializing. It's healthy. Makes you a better person. So, what happens now? Well, next time you want to go out to a big event like that, try and plan it around my shift. Okay? No other agent is gonna let you leave. 
as long as you don't do anything stupid and make sure you're not caught. You're serious? I can go out? Yeah, and if I have to be mean to you, it's not because I want to. It's because I don't want you to get caught. Remember that. By the way, I'm going to be working full time for your dad, so I'll be around a while, okay? If you need any help, don't hesitate to ask. Just be smart about it when you ask me. Oh, and about that girl, I... I lost the love of my life. So, if that girl means anything to you, go be with her. I can do this again. But the goddess kept the mentor's build and voice. Uh, was I supposed to memorize all of that? I, I was just reading it! Uh, is there like a Cliff Notes or something online? Why couldn't someone just simplify it for me? Uh, oh wait, that's what Cliff Notes are. Uh, why do I feel so stupid? Why can't I study right? Uh, I don't want to do college anymore! Why did I pay for this torture? Ugh. Should I ask her out? I mean, we have coffee every now and then, but everyone goes to the cafe and has coffee. That isn't sp anything special. It's just being friends. Oh, maybe the movies. Dinner? Movies and dinner. No, not that. Netflix? No, then she'll think I want something else. Oh, gosh. That's the simple and cheapest option. Why did people have to meme it and make it something more? Ah. Oh. Ooh, I know, the park. Oh, that's a good date. We're in the park, kind of. We're on a date. Huh? Who's that guy? I put your gaff. Hey, baby. Huh? How's it cooking, good looking? Um, I'm studying, not cooking. Cute. Hey, you look amazing in those tights. Got some fine legs. Um, okay. Thank you? Wanna go have a makeout session in the library? What? I mean, you gotta study, and I can help you. Plus, maybe get a little action in while we're at it. Okay, stop! What are you doing? Oh, come on, sweets. I've heard about you. I mean, who hasn't? She looks uncomfortable. Whatever you heard wasn't true, and you need to back off. Hey, is everything all right here? Just trying to get something easy. What? Don't worry about it, Garth. It's nothing. You look really uncomfortable. Af, are you okay? <laughs> look, you need to wait your turn. What's going on? Look, my buddy said that this chick was making out with him the other day. I just want to get in on that action, you know? What? I wasn't! That was a lie! Look, I've known my buddy for years. He's never once lied about making out with a chick. He does it all the time. Sounds like you have an insecure friend. Look, I'm just saying what I heard, babe. And my source doesn't lie. Afma wouldn't do that! Stop trying to white knight her! Excuse me? Stop being a jerk to her for no reason! I'm not being a jerk! If she's gonna act promiscuous, then she should expect this! Wow, big word for a guy with a small brain. <laughs> Thanks. First off, I've never made out with anyone. Your friend is lying. <laughs> Second, you have a nasty attitude towards women, and it's horrible. Just because you assume someone acts a certain way doesn't give you the right to invite yourself to them. You sound like an entitled Ask me if I care what you think. What's your problem? What's your problem? She's an old friend of mine, and I don't appreciate you talking to her like that. Ah, mad you missed out. Okay then. 
Shut up! Look, I get it, bro. You got friend zoned, and now you're looking to get in on this too. But don't worry, I'll let you have seconds. Hey guys, Jess here, and just a quick announcement, I want to let you guys know that we're not going to be having a video 